already. Sixty seconds. Sixty seconds. What? You thought I was playing? I, uh, well, bro, I, I, after after last year, I knew you wasn't playing. You I, was playing? I knew you wasn't playing, but wow! I had, bro, I hadn't even done. An, I hadn't even done an in, I was just getting ready to start an intro. I hadn't even done an intro yet. You know, I, you feel, I know y'all think I just be taking the same fish. Y'all, hey, y'all remember that guy, right? Y'all remember that guy <laughs> right there, I right? Taking the same fish, Yo. over and over. <laughs> I post my pics. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I hadn't even had time to get an intro yet, y'all. Beautiful carp. It's hook pop. Hook pop. Whoa. It almost came out the carp and hooked me. In the eye. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It's TBA. We already in the action. Bam! <laughs> Just got set up, man. He ain't even had that pole out for 60 seconds. We're going to call him the 60 second angler because. He's done that with snakeheads too, man. He'll put a pole out, get ready to do something else, and bam. He had a carp. We saw a swimming right in front of us. I was getting ready to net it, and hook popped out, almost caught old TBA, you know what I'm saying? We out here in an undisclosed location. We're kind of off the grid a little bit. You saw that? We were carp fishing, man. We got funny man Jeff right just, there. Just put the hooks out. Just put them just out, put man. Them out, I mean, literally like 60 seconds, y'all, all right? That's how fast it happens, man. And he knows his carpent, y'all, all right? Anyways, I can see it's gonna be a very active day, so I'm probably not gonna to talk too much. More action, less talking, more fishing, all right? All right, y'all, so in these uh, carp fishing adventures with uh, uh, Jeff here, here's one thing I will say that I've learned the most. Uh, I've fished with these method feeders and hair rigs and I've also fished with just putting a piece of corn on the hook and let me tell you this method feeder setup man it definitely allows for a much more active bite I have definitely noticed it I've seen it with my own eyes uh, you know you can order them online you're not too expensive a lot of stuff comes over from Europe so I'm gonna show you this uh, hair rig real quick the hair rig and the method feeder so that I believe is a half ounce, a half uh, uh, half a gram method leader. All right, because there's a weight on the inside, and we have a pack bait on there, which consists of red jello, sweet corn, and I believe he has oatmeal on there. All right. Now, as for your hair rigs, you can purchase them or you can make them yourself. And that right there, we have a small, I believe that is a size six or seven gamakatsu hook have a piece of uh, fake corn on there. And I have, there was something else I put on there too. I can't remember what it was though. And you actually bind that up with uh, some tubing right there. And then you make your leader. Now, see, I made this one myself. Jeff taught me how to. And I've noticed since I've been using this method for carp fishing, the hookup ratio and the bite is just so much more active than just putting a simple piece of corn on there. Nothing wrong with using a piece of corn, but when you actually use the gear that's designed for it to actually uh, chum out the baits and let the water kind of get that scent going downstream, it ain't too bad, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna cast this pole out, we'll see you on the next fish, all right? All right, second one. Come on, Jeff. Oh, he's big too, bro, he's big. Yeah. I was just trying to bait up and throw uh, my rod back out and that first one took off. Oh! Oh, he's got some. Oh, bro, he's big, bro. Hold you. I can walk him down over there if you need me to. Yeah. I was trying not to fall in. Yeah. Ah, crap. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Folks, y'all remember last time. <sighs> With the smaller ones, this is extra difficult because they bigger. Yeah. <laughs> Wanna get this guy tired? Here we go. <laughs> Got him. That's cool. You, cool. That's how you do it. Oh. 
TBA. Uh, funny man, Jack. Funny man to the fisherman. Woo! Yeah, let's, uh, let's go, baby. Woo! 11.28 with the net. Let's subtract the net out. This guy, <laughs> my 11 pound fighter. Uh. YouTube, want to get a picture for you. Appreciate you get them fins up if you. Well, yeah, like screw you. I ain't getting the fins up. I seen your video last year. <laughs> he's tired. He's tired. Look at this guy. Yeah. Woo. Look at that. A face only a mother could love. <laughs> cool. See, I remembered to bring my boots today, too. Like there they go. Back off to the wild. Peace out. Tell your friends to come take a picture. That's right. Get some of this here food we got. That sweet stuff. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh. Come on in. I feel tugging. Oh yeah. Oh snap. Yeah, he's on. He's on. He's on. He's on. He's on. Oh snap. Okay. He's on. He's on. <clears throat> hey, turn it this way so they can see. Oh, here I go. I can't stop him, dude. I can't stop him. I'm just gonna lift the stick. Okay. I can't. St He's fighting, y'all. He's fighting. <sighs> Come on. I hope I'm pointing in the right direction, y'all. Yeah, you pointing right at me. You good. You Gucci. <laughs> oh, oh, please don't get tangled up in the line. He giving, dude, he must have been hooked for a little bit, bro. Oh, dude, he's going right to the shore. Oh, yeah, yeah. He going That's right smart. to the shore. That's smart. He's going right to the shore. He's going right to the shore. Oh, snap. No. Still pulling. I see the rod still bending. Oh, come on. I'm just trying to keep him from that shoreline. Okay, he's getting close now. He's getting close now. Oh. Let me know when you need to come uh, Yeah, probably here in a second. He's right here. I hope this angle is still uh, such that the live can see what's going on. He's right here in front of me. Ready for the net? Yeah. He ain't that big, but. Oh, my fault. Boy, watch yourself. Watch yourself. Oh, snap. Woohoo! Got him, coach. Ah, let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Woo! Ah, uh, yes. TBA got a skunk off his back. Y'all, you know I'm saying? That's right, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the carp are long out here too, bro. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's number two. Yeah, buddy. That's number two. Woo. All right, maybe I don't need to change the line out. The net weighs uh, 1.27 pounds. You took that off already? Oh, you did? Yep. Okay. Zeroed it out. So he zeroed it out with the net, so we already got the weight uh, incorporated into the weight. 8.9. 8.9 pounds, y'all. Yes, sir. Uh. <laughs> All right, y'all. Carp number two. So now we have four hits, two landings. So now we're, we're doing better. We're at 50% right now. We got an F, but we're still on the board. <laughs> yeah. All right, we're going to release him. All right, homie, let's get, let's get you back. Uh. Let's get you back. Let's get you back, homie. Uh. <clears throat> All right, y'all. Say bye to Mr. Carp here. Oh. Oh, I ain't trying to slip and fall. Oh. Here he goes. Oh, I should have bought my duck boots, man. <laughs> <laughs>